January 6th, 2021. This is going to be studied in the, in the history books. And people are going to be listening to this podcast to know what happened, you know? They, they stormed the Capitol. And from what I could see, there was law enforcement who actually allowed them to no, break what? through the gates. That, oh, that's what they said. I mean, that's what it said. You know, I, I mean, I don't want to spread, but did anything happen to anybody who crashed through? Did you see them climbing up? Here's a question I'm going to ask you. I already know the answer, but I'm going to ask anybody who's listening. If you look at what happened with these people and, you know, they stormed the Capitol, they got into Nancy Pelosi's office, they got into all these Nice, nice. Office, you know, you, yeah, but, you, but wait, yeah, but here's the question. Yeah, if yeah, they yeah. were black, if these people were black, how many would still be alive? I mean, probably be how like- How many would still be alive? 0.07, like, I mean, come on. Like, all right, so first dead. off, shout out to, to, to them for storming in Nancy Pelosi's office because Nancy Pelosi, just- why y'all keep voting for this woman who like she oh my god i cannot stand her but all right but but so they but so they that's that's the only good thing that they've done uh and and i hope that they yeah. get into freaking truck shimmers though <laughs> just you know. well, wait, but wait, i mean wait. but wait 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 that that's for a later show but for right <laughs> now cuz i mean look you know cuz look at the pe- look at the people i mean it's outrageous. Oh my, oh my God. With Confederate flags. With Confederate I, flags. I've seen that. Um, and you know what's crazy um, about this summit is like, that's, that's, that's treasonous, right? Yeah, so, that's treason. You know, you're, you know, you're actually uh, holding a flag of, of a group that not only lost, but who were quote unquote anti-American. So you're really only holding that for one reason. And that is to show racism, white supremacy. Now, I'm pretty sure that it's not it's not an all white crowd. It's I'm not an sure. all white crowd. It's not an all white crowd. Yeah. The Proud Boys yeah. are not all white, which is very bizarre. But they're fascists. Yeah, no, like I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure there are some non white people who think that they're in, but yeah. you know, when it comes down to it, Sima, they're never going to be in, right? That's so right. I mean, it's like you know why? I mean, I don't know. Like you know, for me. That kind of boggles my mind, but it is what it is, right? Like um, now, I'm just curious to see how the government's going to handle this. I'm, I'm, I mean, I, I was, uh, I was, I was talking to my uh, wonderful friend Mel- Melissa, and she told me that Trump had issued an order for people to stand down. But I'm like, didn't he like during like the debates? He said to the Proud Boys, "Stand back and stand." What did he say? I'm sorry, like, this is hilarious to me. Like, Black people, Latinos, Asians, just like every other group other than white have been telling you guys, yo, this is a racist country. We, uh, we need to fix this. You know, punk ass Joe Biden's like, you know, this isn't the America that I, that I, that I know. I'm like, fam, like, this it's the is- the America that I know. Yeah. This is what happens when you don't listen to people, right? This is, this is what happens when you don't, when you do not look at uh, look at things for for what they are for what they are. I mean, this country has always been. I mean, this is a country. This is a country that that um, use that had legal segregation, right? That not too long, not too long ago. Oh my I mean, God! Listen. When you think about it, it is not. It's not too long ago. People try to act like it's so long ago. Color of not law. Too long ago. I got um, that book. Is it good? Oh, right, right. Yo, um, have you read it yet? No. It's so listen, Sima. I read Color of Justice, which was really, really good. So uh who so who who wrote the Color of Justice? I can't remember. Is it uh uh is a is it a woman, Nadra uh Nadir like yo um I don't remember. I think that one's called Color of Wealth. I'm sorry, but all right, look, 